Toches. Toches. Toch. Toches. Very Jewish. Toches. Toches. My people are oppressed too. Toches. Heyman Hustle. My name is Wale. Rap DC, the DMV. And I do my thing in Beverly Hills, 90210 now. Um, my new release is the album About Nothing. It's a, it's a collaborative project with myself and Jerry Seinfeld yeah. from Brooklyn, New York. And Jerry's is such a cool dude, man. And you know, a lot of the things that, that he's wrote, whether it be on the show or, or like just in our, in our conversation in, in the studio, has allowed me to tap into this amazing part of my writing and turn it into some dope songs. 2007, uh, I did a mixtape about nothing. I mean, like, I just developed like a, a following out, like outside of DC. You know, I decided to do a sequel to it, more about nothing. And then with that one, I f***ing put a record on there that Waka Flocka, uh, that, made, that was on his album, that was his single, and it ended up being my biggest record to date, three times platinum. In any middle class anywhere in America, you're gonna find more people that's trying to rap than trying to play sports. Tell me why. Well, you know, you know the, the work that you put into the music is almost like a secret. You know, it's, 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 it's like whatever you, you know, some guys are, some guys are naturally gifted in, in sports, you know, and, um, but the, but the, but you really have to go to practice. Like you really have to, you know, be dependent on a, on a lot of other people. Whereas rap, like, it's all like, one is perception, because you know, it's no real, there's no real stats on how good you can be. Uh, two, it's, um, you're not dependent on nobody. You know, you're not, it's no, you don't, you, you could just do this shit. You could just be in your basement and just rap, you know? And at that point, when I, when I was trying to get on, it, the, the lyrical rappers weren't, you know, the guys that were making the noise in the industry. The ringtone guys was making all the money. No, we're not from West Newberry. No, we can't hip hop like you. My client is the conqueror. I'm just Brock's advocating Jew. When I heard you rap on Monday Night Raw, I was like, my <laughs> nigga. <laughs> I was like, my nigga Paul, man. <laughs> That's what I said. <laughs> you see Jerry, you call him Lil Clean. That's the name we gave him. He was in the studio on the phone with Rick Ross, and he told him, he told us we need, he told us we need a rap, we give him a rap name. So I don't know. That, you see Jerry, you call him. Lil Clean, you know, the Lil Clean, a.k.a. Jerry Seinfeld, a.k.a. Jay Sign. What's the deal with Wale rapping? I mean, is he rapping gifts or? I don't know, George. Get off your tukas and buy it. Tukas, 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 tukas. Get off your tukas and buy it. Tukas, 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 Very Jewish. My people are oppressed too. Tokis. Doing good. Tokis. You're good. You're doing good. Okay. You're an honorary Hebrew. Okay, cool. The Heyman Hustle. Tokus. Perfect. Thank you. That's a wrap. Let's pull down a subscribe button now. Now. Hello? Is anybody paying attention to me?